I've been playing a lot of Arkham Origins lately, and I just finished an anime that reminded me a lot about it, mainly because Batman and the main character share a similar backstory. Samurai Flamenco is a show about a guy who is just starting out as a superhero. He fights small-time, realistic crimes, and... Uh... Uh... Wait a minute. I've been playing a lot of Beautiful Joe lately, and I just finished an anime that reminds me a lot about it. Samurai Flamenco is a show about a guy who is thrust out of his own vision of reality and forced to confront monsters as just a normal guy off the street. He doesn't have anything special to help him. <sighs> Let's try this again. I've been playing a lot of The Wonderful 101 recently. It's one of the many reasons I'm proud to own a Wii U. And I just finished an anime that reminds me a lot about it. Samurai Flamenco is a parody of the many Japanese team superhero shows known as Power Rangers here in the States. The show follows our title character and his team of multicolored allies, fighting off an alien threat, having a giant reunion episode, and defeating an enemy who ends up being on their side, just doing it in the wrong way, before another friggin' theme change! You gotta be kidding me! Who doesn't think I'm gonna pull that sh I've been playing a lot of Arkham Origins lately. I just finished an anime that reminds me a lot about it. Samurai Flamenco is a show about a guy who created his own arch nemesis after a faithful encounter. Flamenco has to stop him before his newest enemy hurts everyone important to him. And then there's probably another theme change and... Uh, oh, oh, this is the last arc. So you might have picked up on how this show has a few theme changes. And if you like the direction that the first episode was going, don't worry, they never entirely come back to it. But if you think the episode 7 twist is the best thing to have in anime, you won't be disappointed. Every episode is just like that. Pure, unadulterated insanity held together under a loose parody of everything superhero. Which, by definition, already are insane. Me, I'm a huge superhero fan. Born and bred on Lois and Clark, Justice League, and Static Shock, and I will admit the first turn took me for a loop. I loved how the first episode played out, and I thought, with the gorillas and such, that the show might have lost its way. However, after a few episodes, I came to grips with reality that it was never going back. I had to let it go, and before I could make another song reference, I was enjoying the show again. I wonder why I didn't see it there before. Okay, that one was just stretching, I'm sorry. Despite all of that, Flamenco has a more serious side, and a darker side, and a softer side. All four arcs are a full story, and ask serious questions. Now, whether they actually answer that question, or if the question needed to be asked in the first place is another thing altogether, but it's the fact that it tries that matters. Visually, the show isn't anything special to look at. Well, the animation can be occasionally a little wonky. Some walk cycles don't match up with the background, and the character models can be a little off at times. It's not enough to make it unwatchable like some shows I could mention, but it's a lack of attention to detail that makes it worth mentioning. As for sound design, nothing really stands out other than the first opening for good reasons, and the ending for bad and hilarious reasons. The show has an unhealthy relationship with the cliffhanger ending, and as soon as they put you off the edge, they kick up this super happy tune. It cuts all the tension that was built up. Like this. See you, space cowboy. Bang. What? Flamenco Girl's been captured? I know not everyone's going to be a huge fan of all the plot twists, but I thought Samurai Flamenco was a thoroughly enjoyable show. It's not a show you have to go out and watch immediately, but if you have some spare time, I'm sure it's a much better marathon than a week-to-week -week viewing. So, Samurai Flamenco gets a 4 out of 10. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got to go do something incredibly evil. <laughs> Ha <laughs> <laughs>
Hey guys, thanks for watching my review. Be sure to leave a like if you really enjoyed my video, and leave a comment stating your opinion on Samurai Flamenco, because that's what this is about, having a nice discussion. And that sounds super cheesy, I know, but doesn't matter. Leave a comment, and subscribe, because you know, you should, because I make good stuff. Come back. I love you. Goodbye.